Is this what Princess Leia would look like if she had to get her wisdom teeth taken out? Probably. Does that mean that I think I'm like Princess Leia? Maybe. Maybe. Welcome to day two. So I uh, woke up pretty late today, um, around 12 o'clock. And just been pretty much just chilling out on my, uh, basically my prescribed Mount Everest of pillows, as you can see. You need to have a, uh, your head up high for the few days after your procedure and stuff so you don't end up with a mouthful of blood, basically. So I've just been chilling out here, uh, you know, on YouTube and stuff. Check out my, uh, so this is what I've been wearing actually. It's this, uh, it's like a headband, but it's got these little, it's kind of like doubled over on itself and you kind of put these little ice packs inside it. And uh, that's probably the main reason why I'm, you know, not ridiculously swollen up like right now. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go into the bathroom because then it's going to sound like I'm in, you know, the back cave and you're not going to hear anything. It's just going to be echoing. So I thought um, what I would do is show you guys the kind of spread I'm dealing with in the well, fall my bed and how that's set up where I've been spending most of my time. But I think I'll show you guys maybe the food I've got prepared and, and set up and everything. So let's go. Let me turn some lights on so you can see. Alright, so here's my fridge. And uh, a lot of stuff in here actually, but most of it I can't actually eat. So what I've been eating is, actually, well, jelly. You know me, last day, jelly is the man. And I like, well, I'm not gonna finish that sentence. Um, so yeah, um, Juice, juice is good. George, just come and check out what I'm doing because he loves food. Um, I've got these things today. A friend of mine dropped these off. These are awesome. They are. I haven't had any of them yet, but Jelly Joy. Slurpy peach jelly drink. It's, it's uh, in a plastic container and easy to drink, so you know it must be good. It looks either Japanese or something, so, you know, extra bonus points. Up and go. Not that I'm doing either of those upping or going, but you know, better be safe than sorry. Um, this where it's at, custard, vanilla custard. I've been gulping that down. Uh, for my ice packs. This one has been wrapping around my head like a uh, like a massive bandana, but upside down. Uh, and uh, these things are good too. I don't even know what they are, but they are. I kind of. I managed to shove these in that small little uh, headband I was wearing before. But uh, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much kept, keeping the swelling down. Someone in the comments did, uh, someone in the comments did say to uh, not talk as much, to keep the swelling down. So yeah, I've kind of been doing that today, but I'm not actually checking my beard out. I'm actually uh, checking for the swelling and stuff, but so far looks looks good. Um, so yeah, ice packs, ice packs, and ice packs, and ice packs, and ice packs. Like the uh, Epic Mealtime version of ice packs. I should make a shirt that just says ice packs, and ice packs, and ice packs, and ice packs. But yeah, keep that swelling down. Although my jaw is pretty sore. Probably from talking. Thanks, guys. Um, what else is there? Oh yeah, applesauce. This stuff is amazing. Can you see that? Yeah. Just from Woolworths. That's, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm eating at night. So yeah, that's mainly it. Um, what else is there? Uh, you know, I ate some uh, scrambled eggs today, which were good again, and some cottage cheese. I actually ate like the whole thing of cottage cheese. I was starving this morning. Yeah, it's actually pretty late in the day now. I slept in pretty late. I got, had a uh, hard time getting to sleep because I'm so awesome. You know, the way I think of it, if you go to sleep the same day you wake up, then uh, it's kind of like quitting, so. I don't know, it's just me. That's George, he snores when he's awake. Mm. Something is wrong here. Much better. That should cover up the swelling. So, today is probably tougher and at the same time, not as tough as yesterday. 
Yesterday, while I guess it was more of a change to what I was used to, you know, going from being healthy to having four of your teeth out and big holes in your mouth. Um, today, it's kind of the swelling, you know, it's, you're a bit more sore. Um, and, uh, you know, you can eat more, which is good. I mean, some people can't even eat until, like, tomorrow even. It's like, the, it's the uh, I guess, the second day after the operation or whatever. Yeah, I can't wait to actually go back to eating, you know, proper food again. Um, but that's just me. I mean, some people might just enjoy baby food. And I'm not judging them. Uh, especially babies. It's designed for you, so you should enjoy that. But I don't think babies normally have their wisdom teeth out. And if they did, they have to be, like, prophet babies. Like, with epic beards who just, like, come out of into the world. And then just, like, yes, I prophesize that you should be whatever. And, uh... But yeah, they're pretty, they'd be like the Methuselah of the baby world if they had their wisdom teeth when they were born. But, you know, anything can happen. Okay, maybe not that, but a lot of crazy stuff can happen. What if all painkillers were just placebos and it was just your body blocking out the pain? So today's been pretty chilled, actually. It's probably making, going to make for a pretty short vlog. So I'll pause this. Just about to watch The Life Aquatic with Steve Zissou, which is probably my favorite film ever, uh, with Bill Murray. Um, but uh, yeah, I think today's probably going to be a pretty short vlog, just because it was kind of like a limbo day. Couldn't really do much. I'm sure I'll have more to do tomorrow. But uh, until then. Dan, did you just eat half a tub of chocolate frosting? Yes, you did. And are you hyper? Mm-hmm. Why do you cry? Good night.